Hello everyone, this is Rocco doing probably, potentially my last 10.8.1 drive. Um, GPS that you, whoa, I can't enable it because it, it doesn't think we're on the road we're on. Um, yeah, so we are doing a drive, I'm actually going out to get a haircut. Um, this is actually one of my playlists. So this will be attached to that and so it's a consistent drive where I do both there there and back we have done this I want to say once with zero disengagements um, when this allows me I will enable it there we go he's <laughs> um, such a pain in the butt get it enabled that for and it's really frustrating but uh, besides that very smooth to get to the light right here I'm gonna go ahead and make it change lanes Again, this is the type of scenario where it doesn't need to be riding in the left lane. If it's not going straight or taking a left turn up here, then no reason it needs to stay in the left lane. That was good. A truck cut out in front. My car, you know, slowed. I didn't jam on the brakes. It went a decent amount of region. Um, but then it kind of just stayed there it did, and then it speed back up and then it's keep on slowing Which is mostly what a human would do very good Okay, so it started breaking um, There right before it changed yellow and then it started speeding back up again as it changed yellow and then obviously slowed back down again uh, it seems to be much more aggressive at wanting to go through yellow lights, and it just can't gauge the distance. Like, we are easily far enough back that the distance, uh, no reason it shouldn't even try to run that. The, to, to run that, you would have to be going 10, 15 over the speed limit to be able to run that light. So 
so it slowed for that truck. It saw that truck kind of peek out, uh, and then it slowed for it as if it was expecting it to cut out in front of me. That's good behavior. <laughs> I can't believe it really did that. It sped back up and cut and cut over in front of this truck. <laughs> and of course, since no one goes 35 on this road, he's probably a little bit annoyed that my car cut out in front of him. But honestly, it's it's fine. It's legal. It's illegal. You know, nothing wrong with it from a legality standpoint. It's just kind of a dick move. Um, let's see. This turn has always been a challenge. It's the way that car is is where we need to go, and it merged into this into this turn lane very well, and we are good to go. A little bit close to that car, a little bit close to that car, and I that shouldn't have disengaged. We're not going to count that one. I was holding the wheel um, very tightly. In 500 feet, your destination will oh, be on the right. That almost was a disengagement. I was holding the wheel very tightly because um, uh, I didn't, well, it was getting pretty close the to the curb. Destination is so it was close to the curb. Um, and so, well, our destination is actually up here, but it's just straight. So, of course, that's going to be fine. So we had one true disengagement on this this tire drive and that was merging onto the highway. Version 11, um, at some point, version 11 is going to fix that. Version 11 is going to, uh, of course, uh, make all the uh, single stack and it's going to make merging onto the highway much more pleasant and smooth. Um, but yeah, well, we are going to see how it does on the way back. And we are back, everyone. Let's see how it does on this intersection. This is gonna be our main mess up area right here. Now turn right onto okay, so it's gonna highway. go into the curb there. That was a disengagement. It seems to be much more hesitant on the curbs. And, okay, you can go. I don't wanna wait. Yeah, so I had to press it there so I could actually get out. This is one of the rare times it's completely open, trying to get onto this road here. You know, I definitely needed to go there. Really? Wow. Okay. It's a break, a break a tiny bit, but that did fine. It could have just slowed instead of breaking right there, but yeah. turn on their brights behind. Actually, you know what? We're going to slow down. Screw them. Brake checked them. So, yeah. That's what can happen when full self-driving cuts, cuts people off. Considering I handle that pretty well. Um, not too happy about that, uh, but yeah. Okay, so it just kind of stopped turning right there. Not sure why, so I took over. And now, fortunately, they're staying their distance behind me. So that's nice. Of course, it turns the blinker on to the left. I made it through that light. Good. A single person 
in my way to merge onto this highway, so it's all the merge on good. And it turns the blinker on at the absolute last second. I shouldn't do that. I should go ahead and merge onto the highway before they end the lane. Should really, in my opinion, never use the end of the lane unless you have to. right here. Fortunately the last handful of updates haven't reproduced this issue where it tries to turn right here. You'll occasionally see the tentacle flip back and forth but it does not um, try and turn right which is good. We're just creeping, we're good to go, I'm tapped the accelerator, you're just in the middle of the road. <laughs> so I'm pressing the accelerator to keep it going. Um, stuff like that's annoying like there are no cars coming like at all and it decides we're just not gonna go we're just gonna kind of stay here in the middle of the road it doesn't really make any sense i don't know so probably <laughs> I, I, I don't want this to be clickbait but it is man it, full self driving cause road rage basically that that's what it is um it um it cut out in front of that car honestly i didn't think that was that bad of an issue though the issue being it went too slow it was going too slowly going the speed limit <laughs> which I mean come on you can't really complain that much but um yeah. but yeah and then it cut out in front again when they went to go turn because they didn't get in the turn lane soon enough yeah so some issues to work on um otherwise that's gonna be the end of this video everyone I appreciate you sticking uh, out with me I'm not sure we're gonna have any more videos maybe one more but it'll be probably next week um and until then I'll see you in the next video thanks everyone bye